What's up everybody, Sylvie here. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful day. Today is Friday and I am in Vaughan and my backdrop is this wonderful, beautiful nature. I'm surrounded by nature, which I love. What am I doing here on a Friday afternoon? Why ain't you at work, girl? I am at work. I'm on momager duty today. So my son is filming in, in this beautiful nature scene. And uh, as the mother of the talent, uh, we just kind of chillax and wait, wait around, lots of waiting while the kids um, do their shooting. How did I end up here? And why am I not at a conventional job? Let me tell you, it's all about leading a life by design meaning you make intentional decisions in order to secure the kind of life that you would really prefer to be living. If many of you don't know, I am a voiceover artist. I've been doing it for 16 years. And while it's not a job that pays every two weeks, when I do land jobs, they tend to be pretty lucrative at times. And that coupled with a few other um, income streams allow me to free up my time to be able to do this, what I'm doing now. Sitting on a red Muskoka chair, waiting for my son as he films with a group of other kids, and I get to enjoy this nature. I get to be on set. I get to watch my son do something that he loves to do. Leading a life by design is not an easy thing. You have to make certain sacrifices. But when you think about the alternative, which to me is a soul crushing nine to five, um, I'll make that sacrifice. What do I mean by sacrifice? Well, having non-conventional job, it means sometimes not having um, income come in on a regular basis. And so you have to learn how to save. You have to learn how to make do, all right, when you're in between the times of getting those paychecks. It means sacrificing friendships, relationships at times, because there are many people out there who really just don't understand or don't care to understand the idea of leading a life by design. And for me, that is the absence of a nine to five. I was not built for one. And as a result, um, since 2020, I really haven't had to work a regular nine to five. I had one part-time role a few months back and it was a contract. Aside from that though, I have other streams of income that supplement my lifestyle. To me, it's living a life where I get up in the morning and I'm not dreading going to work. I'm not sitting in traffic. I'm not complaining about coworkers. There's no office politics. And while I'm not a stranger to that, I've definitely had my stint in the corporate world. I prefer a world where my working life consists of doing things that I like to do. Like today, I am accompanying my son to his acting job. And when I'm not doing that, I am working on other streams of income. I am a voiceover artist. I have also a small business. Um, I do e-commerce. There's a lot of things that I do in order to circumvent the nine to five. And to me, it's the only way to live. I don't like the idea of punching a clock. I don't like the idea of somebody telling me how productive or not productive that I should be um, with my day. Anyway, I say all of that to say this to anyone out there, especially my 40 plusers out there. I just started this channel and after starting and restarting and restarting this channel several times, I have finally found a groove within this channel of mine. I'm building a community with you guys. 
I'm really enjoying reading your comments. I'm really loving doing this, um, putting out content that I feel is going to serve you, content that I feel is going to help, that adds value um, to your life. You have responded um, in such a organic and beautiful way. It touches me very, very deeply. And it is my hope to continue to do this um, because this too, this YouTube thing, can also become an income stream for me. And I'm getting closer and closer all the time. Wasn't expecting my channel to reach 1,000 subscribers in 30 days because I've tried YouTube several times and failed. But I'm not one to give up. And that's my message to you guys. To lead a life by design, you have to focus on what your wants and desires really are and start taking the steps in order to facilitate getting the life that you want. I don't know where this channel is uh, going to lead me, but I do know that at this particular time, it is a pleasure for me to put out content that I feel helps people, encourages people, and helps you to perhaps look at yourself to be able to think, hey, how can I improve my life? How can I lead a life by design? Because we all have it in ourselves. If you're 40 plus and you're not on YouTube yet, I don't know what you're doing, girl because there's not enough of us on here. We have so much life lessons to share. We have so many stories. We have so much experience. We've lived and we've survived. <laughs> and while you don't think that what you have to say matters, you'll never know unless you start posting. If I tell you that I never knew that posting a video about my gray hair journey would net almost 40,000 views and counting. If somebody told me that this is the kind of content that I would need to put out for people to actually resonate with, I would have laughed. And now look at me. I took a chance and I also decided that I myself want to continue to lead a life by design. And YouTube can help me with that. It can not only help me express myself and document certain aspects of my life journey, I can help people in the process. And let's be real, I can monetize my channel the same way I've monetized my talents, which are allowing me to be here today in this nature waiting for my son to come from wherever he is filming so that I don't have to be stuck at a job that I hate. I'm so glad that I figured out a long time ago that in order to lead a life by design, you have to be courageous. You have to do the research, but most importantly, you have to execute. You gotta execute, guys. So my message to you guys out there is when you lead a life by design, a life that allows you to be free of the shackles of a nine to five, you have to make concerted efforts and take needed steps in order to forward your agenda, right? And every decision that I'm making is leading me ever closer to the ideal life. Today is another example for me of just the gratitude that I feel for this moment right now. To be out here in the sunshine, surrounded by nature, as my son does something that he loves and I'm sitting here just waiting for him surrounded by this
all of this. We can all lead a life by design if we take chances, if we have faith that things are going to work out, and if we don't quit. Never that. So that's all I have to say, guys, for today. I just wanted to hop on real quick. Nothing fancy, um, but I, I needed to talk about this. This was important. Um, I hope that you guys have a great day. I'm going to finish enjoying my day here, wait for my son to come back, and um, maybe I'll go for a walk. Take care, y'all. And by the way, again, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for your comments. If you are so inclined, please feel free to subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.